oh yes hello viewers appearing on your screen is nathan matrovo here at kisa projects today we are here to show you how to trim a book using a book cutting grotine machine yeah this is the book i've just been binding from the other side now I've finished binding it now i want to give it a smooth finish or a perfect end by using a book cutting grotine yeah stay tuned let's get started here we come Yeah, now here is our book cutting guillotine still in the box. We are going to unbox it or remove it from the box. Then we shall show you its parts. Uh, some parts need to be assembled. Then after assembling it, we shall put it on our table. Then we start using it for our book trimming. Here we go. Use a paper cutter to cut through this sealing tape so that you can open your guillotine and remove it from the box yeah here it is Maybe let's first show you how it is, how it looks while still in the box. Oh yes, this is our machine after unboxing it. Uh, this is a cutter handle. We press it here. This is a cutter lock, this one. And I lift the handle above at the extreme end. This one locks it. Now it is locked, it can't come back down. Yeah. Now this is our book, the one we have just bind. It's rough, rough at the extreme end, so we need to make it smooth using a book cutting video time. Now this is a movable file. It can be moved. This side and the other side up. This is the base. This is a movable file. Now, on, sorry, this is this is a movable handle. This is a movable file. On the movable file, we have a toolbox. So I get part of my tools. These are my tools. Then I need to properly properly fix this handle. I'm doing it right. Let me first see. Not maybe. Yeah, like this. I need to properly fix it. It's supposed to be like this. Oh, sorry. This is an easy to use machine. If you need it, you can get it ready available here at Kisa Projects. Yeah, it's not costly. And you can ship it to your home country. If you're in Uganda, you can still deliver it to you anywhere in Uganda. This is an Allen key, the one I'm using. I use an Allen key to tighten. To tighten this handle. Yeah. So I put it back to my toolbox. Yeah. So this is a movable file. This is a movable handle. This is the base. This is the cutter handle. This is the cutter lock. This is the plastic file. This one is the plastic file. Now when I rotate the plastic handle, the plastic file comes up like this. This one, the plastic file is coming up because I'm rotating the plastic handle. Now, this is our steel blade. 
this is the steel blade that cuts the book for instance if i press the cutter lock down if i press the cutter lock down like this if i press the cutter lock down then i press the cutter handle if i move the cutter handle downwards then the cutter goes on getting down and cutting whichever equipment it finds in place like this like this now cutting and after cutting i bring it back up like that then it locks itself automatically now this is the machine handle for lifting the machine you lift this handle this is so for instance this is our book this is the cutting pad this is my book for instance i put it here i want to cut off this area then i rotate the cutter handle so that the cutting the plastic file holds the book tightly firmly like this so when i'm placing the cutter handle the blade comes onto the book like this when i continue to press i cut the papers and i make my book very fine it's what we are going to see right now keep watching now remember this is our base this is my book newly bind book so this base has measurements or a ruler on it so they show us where we have to cut from for instance this book of mine is for a4 size so if you want to cut if i want to cut f4 then i have to look for f4 size on the on the base here they show me f3 this is b4 this is f4 which means i shall i have to stop at this line so i, I have to bring the movable file i move it up to that line of f4 like this then i lock it family exactly then i bring my book this is my book closer to this file this movable file that's it now our next step i'm going to move this movable handle i'm going to keep on tilting it or rotating it such that the plastic file slips on top of my book and holds my book family to enable me to do the cutting perfectly now i want you to clearly see this part remember i said this is a plastic file so when i rotate this movable file like this no like this the plastic file goes on slipping down towards my book this one so i have to make sure that it is firmly tilted like this now it has holding my book firmly even if i try to check 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 my book it can't be moved moved so the next step will be cutting remember i said this is a cutter lock so when i press it down i can i can now move my cutter handle towards close to my book now you are seeing the blade the blade is sitting on the book when i continue pressing the cutter handle the blade goes on cutting the book simple as that as simple as that now let's see how fine our book looks so i remove the plastic file onto my book oh wow the book looks so fine and attractive so now we have finished cut cutting this side so we need to cut this side as well so we look for f4 f4 steel where is f4 here we have f4 still have to look for f4 here side f4 f4 here then still i lock my movable file I bring my book through that the movable file so that it aligns straight then i push downward the movable handle the plastic 
file will be moving down. Close that my books. Close that my book. Holding my book tight. Something of nature. Boom. The next step. Placing the lock down. Then moving the blade towards the the book. As simple as this. simple as that Hope you have enjoyed watching how our machine does the cutting perfectly. Now this is our finished book. It looks nice, nice with a smooth finish, having used our uh, book cutting video time. This is how my book looks like. You can buy it for your business purposes. For instance, we're bookbinder.com. You need to start a business of bookbinding. Yeah, you can come here at Kisa Projects Africa and you get your machine. See how our book looks? It looks nice and perfect. If you don't know how to do book binding, you can still come here at Kisa Projects Africa and we train you in the art of book binding and start making beautiful books like, like this. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel at Kisa Projects Africa. Also, don't forget to like our Facebook page at Kisa Projects Africa. Yeah.